Find out which state is providing $2 million in new housing initiatives. This is awesome, really cool. How almost 90% of the rental assistance disaster relief funds have not yet been distributed. This is a nightmare. I'm gonna tell you how much has been put out and how much is left. So you don't wanna miss out on that. And the amazing news of President Biden teaming up with the Department of Treasury to prevent evictions across America. So stay tuned. Hey everybody, it's Andrew Cartwright here. Um, here is your eviction moratorium, housing stimulus and real estate infrastructure stimulus and rental protection update. My goal is to give you access to government and private money for yourself, loved ones, and your business. Why there's a, a loan link down below for small business and for yourself, 12 different programs, 75 banks, interest rates is low. It's uh, 2.86, I believe it is now. Stay tuned to the channel for personal finance videos, real estate, crypto, stock market, credit, and other investments to generate your income and save you loads of money. Awesome, I'm giving away $2,000. All you gotta do, subscribe, join the, join the channel like the video just smash the like button give us a piece of your mind in the comments we're gonna pick one of those peace of minds and we're going to give away two thousand dollars we're gonna randomly pick it as soon as we hit two hundred thousand subscribers so help us get there really appreciate you smashing the like button and, and subscribing so we can get to the two hundred thousand subscriber mark also grab your weeble stock down below two stocks valued up to sixteen hundred bucks make sure you don't miss out on that also, my Patreons, thank you so much for supporting the channel for as little as $3, uh, five articles a week, as well as a look under the hood of my investments and my real estate program. Don't miss out on that $99, a $10,000 course. It's how I do all this stuff. Spent $45 million making mistakes so you don't have to. 36 videos, resource lists, when to buy, how to buy, market cycles. Just about it. I mean, there's so much. It's ridiculous. You're going to feel like you stole something. It's, uh, you pay with PayPal, so it's safe, $99. It's incredible. When to buy, how to buy, and also how to not even use your own credit. So make sure you check it out. First couple of videos are free, so you can see if, you're, if you like it. If not, yeah, it's cool too. But first, a new housing program in the great state of Virginia looks to provide citizens at risk of homelessness with $2 million in disaster relief funds. The RRRC, Executive Director, Patrick Mooney said, quote, the $2 million grant would be used as leverage for projects that meet regional housing needs that may not otherwise move forward. So great news. Councilman uh, Ron Russell states, quote, it's important for the integrity of it that it's more than just an apartment building for low income, end quote. I couldn't agree more, and I hope that anyone in financial situation like this, stressed out, can receive the fiscal support needed to keep a roof over their head. These programs are all over the country, as well as the federal government, which I'm gonna talk about later, but how much has gone out and how to get that money. You need to go grab it. Meanwhile, a shocking report I'm gonna talk about right now, the Treasury found that roughly 89%, yep, almost 90% of the federal rental assistance Funds to prevent evictions have not been distributed, even though a court, you know, Supreme Court is like, hey, we're going to give you a chance to get this money out there so you don't have to pay landlords. Well, landlords and renters, there's, it's broken, folks. The Emergency Rental Assistance Program has distributed about $5.1 billion, still a lot of dough, uh, towards the, the $46.5 billion rental assistance program. So only like, what, 11% has gone out the door better than what it was the last time I reported though. Gene Sterling explains, quote, it's just not close to enough in an emergency like this to protect all the families who need and deserve to be protected. So there is still way more to do and to do fast, end quote. So true, Fox News, Peter Dosi says, quote, uh, right now, as we understand it, many states are not distributing that money just it stopped hopefully these funds can start hitting the streets soon in your neck of the woods as millions of americans are currently struggling and desperate maybe one of those i hope you're not but it's possible you are that you get the vital disaster relief funds that are set aside for you the stimulus rental assistance get with your landlord get with your tenant go get this money before it runs out so that nobody loses out 
Finally, President Biden earlier today, uh, he is taking a new step to prevent evictions with the White House and also teaming up with the Department of Treasury um, to keep Americans in their homes. The Department of Treasury is, quote, providing even more explicit permission, right, for guarantees to utilize, to utilize self attestation without further documentation, documentation in order to speed up the delivery of assistance to households in need during the public health emergencies. The White House also noted these policies, I'm going to cover what that means, um, to accelerate the assistance to thousands of applicants who are in the pipeline in many states and local programs on top of those who are already received there uh, through the end of July. This is great news for all my viewers. This is what it means. Self-attested means if you say it, it's true. Self-attested, meaning you attest to it. I don't know why these attorneys and politicians talk in riddles sometimes, but they have to. The legal jargon's the legal jargon. So the jargon is this. Rather than you proving a bunch of stuff, in order to get this money on the streets, they're saying, you know what? We're going to help people by saying, if you say it's true, it probably is. We're going to trust you. This is great news for all the viewers that need these important disaster relief funds to avoid eviction, and hopefully our pol political leaders can get these funds out as sooner, sooner than later. Maybe explain it better, because almost everybody I've told that self-attested to, they're like, huh? What? Self who? Attest? Who's that? I don't know a test. Is she, some, is she a friend of yours? No, she's not a friend of mine. Yes, so what it means is, they're going to take your word for it. And uh, I'm not an attorney. If you need legal advice, obviously talk to an attorney. If you need uh, assistance with this, you should talk to somebody in your state about your assistance. But definitely make sure you get it. They're going to make the process so much easier now. Thank goodness. This is incredible news for you. Millions of Americans across the country because this money will probably finally get out the door. So stay safe out there. Take care of yourself. They did this also with the PPP where they said, look, we're going to just let people self-attest. I was in there with the banks when they went through that process. So um, anyway, take care. Love you. There are women that go to the barbershop and there are guys that go to the hair salon. So if I'm a guy and want to come here, would yes. you include me? How would I look with dreads? Uh, Not so much. Nah. Who does this? Who, are, are you okay? 